Nearly 10% of the battery never makes it to the car. Why is that? Because of the scrap during production. According to S&P Global Mobility, the scrap produced during the manufacturing of a battery ranges from 4 to 12%, depending on the supplier quality. But when it comes to a newly installed production line or a new supplier entering, this scrap varies from 15 to 30%, and that's a huge amount. So at the battery show, I met a company called Hosokawa Alpine AG, which specializes in manufacturing machines with which a company can basically recycle the production scrap. So they have various stages and they have various machines that they deliver, but they can be divided into three main stages. So first, right off the bat, there is a production scrap. The second most important stage is the delamination of cathode and anode material. And for the final stages, it goes into fine grinding, where the cathode and the anode material can be extracted into powder form. They can work with both NMC as well as LFP batteries. Let's suppose a manufacturer is going to produce a new batch of electric batteries. So he has to take over 90% new material and 10% of the recycled material. And in this way, they can achieve a very valuable yield of electric batteries which is not only sustainable, but also cost effective. If you are interested in EV automotive, as well as in battery technology, please subscribe to my channel and you can share it. Thank you so much. Take care. Bye-bye.